Hey guys, Andrew here with Drew Fit. I want to thank you for tuning in. Today's video, I want to be sharing my testimonial and kind of give you guys an overview on Mastic Gum, specifically the brand Greco Gum. Uh, this is the most popular brand that I've come across of the Mastic Gum um, that has the most positive reviews. There are some that I came across on Amazon um, that I wasn't too sold on. I had a lot of mixed reviews, but Greco Gum does seem to be a very reputable company. So um, I've been chewing it for one week and I would highly recommend them so far. Um, so to give you guys an overview, so this is Mastic Gum coming from the Mastic Tree uh, in the Greek island Chios, I believe it's called. Um, and the way they extract this resin is, I believe it's when the bark is falling off the tree as a, I think, defense mechanism or a regenerative mechanism, it reduces this resin. And the resin can be seen here. They look like little kind of off-white yellowish crystals come in all different shapes and sizes. I'll pull one out here for you guys. So this one's a really small piece, but you guys kind of get the gist. Thin. Um, the chewing consistency is very interesting. Um, it breaks down kind of like a glass at first, and then in a few seconds, turns into a chewy resin that's very tough. Um, and the great thing about it being very tough is that it's fantastic at exercising the uh, muscles of your jaw, um, stemming from, you know, your jaw muscles from here all the way up to the side of your head. Um, and it's been said to have a lot of good benefits um, in improving, you know, not just the strength of your bite, but your overall look. Um, it gives you a stronger looking jawline, stronger looking head shape, and helps with the skeletal structure of your face as well, which actually does have a lot of health benefits. Um, but to, you know, talk about the gum a little bit more, I wasn't able to come across a lot of, um, you know, randomized control trial studies on this gum. Those are going to be pretty hard to come by. There are a lot of testimonials and uh, some very interesting information as this is a uh, traditional medicine, uh, per se. It's been used for over thousands of years. Um, some of the benefits, it's been called an antioxidant, antimicrobial, and anti-inflammatory. Now, I'm not exactly sure what property that is of the gum. I'm trying to look that up myself, but if you guys know, drop it in the comments because I find it very interesting some of the benefits that are noted here. Um, for me, so far in my first week, what I've noticed um, number one, like I said, it really strengthens the jaw muscles. You'll notice when you're eating other food how easy how easily it breaks down. Um, another thing it does is it's really great at cleansing the mouth. So I think it's really beneficial for your oral health. And it's been said to help with things like gingivitis or um, any issues with the gums and teeth as well. If you're dealing with cavities, um, it's been said to help uh, overcome cavities as well. Now, I'm not saying this is going to cure any of those things. I don't want to get in trouble for saying that. Um, I've just seen testimonials and, you know, people citing specific, I don't know what studies they are, um, making these claims. But it is very interesting because I have noticed significant benefit in just one week of trying this product. Um, another thing I thought was very interesting was the color of my tongue. Now, this might gross you out, but I am going to stick my tongue out. Um, every now and then, depending on what kind of foods I'm eating, I will kind of have like that white film layer on your tongue. And if you can look closely, you know, it's not terrible um, right now, but it is starting to slowly go away. And a lot of that um, has to do, uh, what are some of the benefits here? It says, you know, as being an antimicrobial, it's obviously going to help with your gut health. And a lot of people that have that white layer on their tongue, a lot of people cite that as like a candida overgrowth. Um, they'll use a tongue scrubber, which, you know, that's great and all, but are you really getting to the root issue? I believe um, if you have bad bacteria in your mouth, that obviously means that you have something going on in your, in your digestive system. And that is a lot of what this gum helps out with is stomach issues. Um, I wrote some notes here. Um, it's been said it can reduce stomach pain, heartburn, irritable bowel disease, uh, soothing of stomach ulcers, which is interesting, uh, can reduce H. pylori. I saw one claim saying that can even kill off H. pylori completely, which is very intriguing. Um, it's been said to also regulate blood sugar levels and improve cholesterol. Now, though, I know there are a lot of claims, and I don't want to, you know, just say all those things and get you excited to go out and buy this stuff, but 
Um, I think it's very uh, worth, gonna be worth your while to look into this at the very least. I highly suggest it. Um, and to give you guys a rundown of how I do it, I do about one to two pieces. Some of the chunks in there are pretty big, but um, I'll kind of gauge it on, you know, when you're chewing, like, is that too much or too little? Um, but I'll do one at a time until it feels right until they're all broken down and like, do I want to be walking around with a big wad of gum in my mouth uh, to where you can barely talk? No, you don't want to do that probably, but I'll take probably two pieces at a time, chew it down. Um, and the interesting part is this gum can last for hours. And I've had, you know, a couple pieces that I've been chewing on for two days in a row, probably three hours each time. So six hours for one piece of gum. So if you use this stuff, properly it can be worth your while you know i think this canister cost me like 30 35 dollars um and it's said to last anywhere from four to six weeks which is a pretty good um investment for your oral health and your overall gut health as well um if these claims are true and i'll i'll, I'll come back on here with you guys in probably another couple weeks and give you my you know like one month update to see how things are going but Another thing I noticed is sometimes when I eat foods that don't really agree with me, I will get a little bit of heartburn. And I notice if I eat and chew this about an hour after, that heartburn never even comes up, which is fantastic. So it is doing something mechanistically. I'm not able to, you know, kind of break it down and let you know what is going on. But it is worth looking into. Um, the taste, it's going to be very piney at first, and then it kind of goes into like earthy tones afterwards. Um, your mouth feels very fresh and clean after chewing it, which is pretty cool. Um, I feel like my teeth have gotten whiter. I don't know if you, if you can tell that, but, um, you know, it's, it's very interesting stuff. I think it's pretty cool. Um, if you guys have any other questions, comments, uh, drop them below and I'll leave a link in the description. If you guys are interested, I'm not affiliated yet. Um, but if I do get an affiliation code, um, I'll be the first to let you guys know. Maybe they give you like a 10% off discount or something. Um, but I hope you guys like this video and please subscribe. Thanks.